this one test. Very thin, very fast, um, very lo and low dose technology. A computed tomography or CT scan is giving promise to high risk patients who until recently had little hope for early lung cancer detection. So the theory is if you can find a lung cancer in its earliest stage in a small form and possibly treat it or remove it, then there would be a very high, uh, a higher likelihood of curing it. The ability to produce highly detailed images with the same radiation exposure as a mammogram is how these scans have reportedly reduced the risk of middle-aged and elderly smokers dying from lung cancer by 20 percent. And up to this point, there are very few interventions that we've seen that will definitely demonstrate an improvement in survival. Take a look at these two images. On the left is a chest x-ray, the right a CT scan, both taken from the same patient. Notice how the x-ray shows a clear image, but the CT scan picks up the less than one centimeter malignant tumor. My mom smoked and my dad. And I started at an early age, by 15, I started smoking. Exposure that caused Trisha's CT scan in December 2012 to pick up several nodules and lead to doctors diagnosing her with stage one lung cancer, caught early enough to save her life. I go back for another scan and, you know, knock wood, hopefully I will have another clean bill of health. As new guidelines continue emerging to improve early detection, experts hope that a combination of heightened awareness, new screening tools, and research will be key to a cure. Jennifer Guerreri, University Hospital's Case Medical Center News Service, Cleveland, Ohio.